This is now the, the way of understanding that mate and the importance of women in Islam, the importance of women in spirituality and how much Prophet put in importance upon them and the love and the respect upon them and that your children their paradise is under the feet of your mother. And how much it's abused now and how much it's taken advantage now and how much all around us marriages are collapsing. Allah describing humans where you are an oppressor to yourself. If we talk to people who are out and doing crazy things in life they don't think that they're oppressing themselves at all, they actually think they're having fun. So then whom Allah is, is referring to that you are an oppressor to yourself? Allah not caring only for the physicality because the physicality goes back to the dirt. What then is Allah worried about? What is He warning us about? Is that I gave to you a, a zawj. I gave to you from your reality in heavens. And then the turuqs begin to teach that your physicality is the male aspect of your body for men and women it doesn't make a difference this is a haqqaiq. We have to speak in a language for people to have an understanding. Your body, your physicality is your Islam, it's your shield. Your Islam has to be strong, your deen has to be strong, the body has to have istiqam and firmness because it's guarding something very precious inside. It's guarding a cargo from Allah